Okay, so this is everything that got cast during the batch casting process. You can see the 3D printed parts with the sprue orientation are stacked with uniform flow dynamics. Okay, and this is similar to um, the large star, but with a different sprueing mechanism, you can see the 3D printable sprue stack worked just as good. So we've got relatively uniform casting, and these can just be desprued. Um, one thing you want to consider is when we did the moon part, uh, the sprueing here was just to the edge and that worked fine. These cross members are a separate part of the component. They are not part of the sprue system. They were just sprued this way because it added stability to the parts and allowed the sprue systems to cross function with each part in the structural assembly. So just a little trick you can do if you know you've got two parts and they need posts on the back. Sometimes it's easier to design it so you can cut these in half and keep the legs on the back of your part while giving your cast part some stability.